Here at New Way, we're testing one of our air turns. This particular one is made of carbon fiber components with our signature porous media surface on it. You can see that we've got a substrate hanging over it on these weights, so there's about 40 pounds across this length, or one pound per linear inch, because it's about a meter across. Then we've got the capability to do measurements at different points. These pads are actually over holes that run through so that we can measure the pressure on the other side. You'll see that in a minute of the air gap that's, of the air that's in, the, in the air gap. But we're experimenting to see what the gap is as it enters into the curvature and what it is in the middle and what it is on the ends and how we can affect it. We've also got six separate zones that uh, we can address with different pressures designed into this air turn assembly. We're using an eddy current probe here so we can resolve a millionth of an inch or uh, certainly we can resolve a micron and then you'll see that we've got uh, pressure sensors and flow meters, mass flow meters, um, and uh, readout devices for the eddy current so we can measure the displacement and know the pressures both into the air turn face and in the gap itself. Here in the back you can see the structures based off of a carbon fiber tube with foam core webbing and also additionally carbon fiber webbing. You can see how the air pressure is being addressed in six different zones and we've got also pressure sensors that are all coming to the end of the system here and uh, we're experimenting with understanding how it also bends under the load of the substrate weight. Okay, you can see here that when we grind the OD of these air turns, we're using another air bearing assembly. So this has been ground very accurately and it becomes an accurate axis of rotation for us to grind the correct cylindrical profile onto the face of the air turn.